Alright guys, we are back and uh, well if you guys didn't see, Christian won the X Division Championship thanks to Unico. Distracting Phoenix, he would have pushed him off the ladder, but unfortunately Unico said, nope, sorry, you lose your title. But you get a, but Phoenix will be cashing in this rematch very soon, so my money is that you're putting it on a ladder match. My, that's what my money is, they're going to put a stipulation on that, because that's the only title when, it, when that match is defended. It'll have a stipulation. Either a TLC match, like we just saw. Bunk is on a roll. Oh, it's a shame that we don't hear this theme as much anymore. Here comes the television champion. Because we know for a fact on Sun on tomorrow. And here comes Dolph Ziggler and Jack Swagger. Of course, Dolph, of course, Dolph Ziggler. In the next game, he's WWE Champion, but here, he's absolutely nothing. But since this is a tornado tag team, so this is probably going to be a heel beatdown. Nice spine buster by Brodus. Thanks. Oh, what does Swagger do? I think he may have hit his own tag team partner by accident. Uh oh, do, we, do I see a split happening? Yeah, vintage Ziggler. Oh, here we go. Um, Swagger. Uh, uh, sw swagger times at the essence here. Nope. Here it is. Zigzag. Zigzag. One, two, three. And it is a heel beatdown. I'm right. As always. <laughs> Yep, I knew it. Wait, what the hell? Are you kidding me? Are you serious? Well, looks like we're going to need a uh, replacement match for the pre-show now. We're going to have a tag team of Brodus Clay and... Oh, fuck. And, oh, shoot, I forgot to change it. Uh, it's going to be a normal pit. What, one fall to a finish. Hooray, you screwed up. Hope you learned your day seed. Oh, my God. I can't believe I screwed that up. It should be false count anywhere. Not a normal one-on-one -on -one match. Bad, Michael, bad. I'm an idiot sometimes. But it's almost 2 in the morning. Oh wait, I'm sorry. It is 2 in the morning. And, uh, oh, of course. It would have led to an ambush. Of course would lead to an ambush. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to quit the match and then reset.
We're gonna reset. There you see the over the limit pre show here. And uh, oh, you gotta be kidding me. I have to do it again. Uh, Mr. Triple H. Well, at least that one's reasonable. That's at least that's a pay per view quality. Okay, me versus. No, not me versus a diva. No, that's too. Not, that's not PG. Here we go. Okay, match simulator. Falls count anywhere. Play. It's gonna be a falls count anywhere match. And me and gender! I. Uh, what's going on? I picked Ollie. Gee, I wonder what's going on. I guess Ginger's volunteering for Ollie. Oh, I forgot they're. I'm forming them into a tag team. That's right. That's what I'm doing starting with at the next pay per view. I want to make them tag team champions. Oh, I forgot about that. I forgot about that. Uh, but knowing Ollie, I guess. I gotta play as Jinder Mahal, I guess, as Ali. Let's see. Well, here I come. Not getting ambushed this time. Woohoo! Three stages of hell. You gotta love it. And you know what I just realized? And there's Ollie, there's Ollie. And you know what I just realized? I picked, no one played it. Yep, so we're gonna see. But actually, you know what, actually? Since it's going to get late, we're going to sim this. Either way, we're going to have a third stage of hell here. So, Because if Jinder actually beats me, I'm going to be so PO'd. No, you know what? You know what? The video's not long enough. We're going to... Okay... We're gonna play it because, well, to be fair, it's only gonna be a lot easier. It'll be Ali versus me. Please don't let it be gender again. That would be really annoying. Although that was kind of entertaining. Oh. Ah, oh, that, that sucks. There we go. Here we go, now watch, it's going to be going to show up gender again, watch. Nope, but... Philip Fry? I thought he was a baby face. Game, what are you doing? That match, the Mike Vermelli 1 Championship, is going to be on the line and over the limit. Are you kidding me? And you're, you're signing with Ali? Give me a freaking break. You know what I'm going to do? I'm gonna nail him to send him through a table. Are you kidding me? Well, Ali is a Saudi Arabian pretty boy, so I guess that makes a bit of sense. Alright, we already saw my entrance. We can skip that. But why is Philip Fry in Ali's corner? He should be in my corner. And there's three stages of hell match. It is a sneaky attack, but where's where's Philip Fry in all this? Uh oh, it's over. It's over. 
It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. One. Oh, whoa. Well, at least it's not over yet. There goes Jerry's water bottle. Wait, instead of doing an announce table, wait. This is my falls count anywhere. Can we actually pin him on the table? No, wait, no, not that. Can we pin him? Yes, we can on the announce table. One, two, three. And the score is tied at one. Ali Ghirardelli. And the third stage of hell is going to decide it. Decided, but why did it mention Philip Fry? There's a steel chair. That's setting up the inferno match at over the at over the limit. So, ladies and gentlemen, that concludes our little marathon of WWE 13 Universe mode here. But just for curiosity, the card you see are not going to be the actual card. Let's see what the match is here. We got United States Johnson versus The Miz. That match is not going to happen. Tag Team Championship. That one's going to stay. Intercontinental. That one's going to stay. John Cena, Big Show. And, wow. Well, we're going to... The John Cena match. We got to put John Cena in here somehow. The Intercontinental title match. Uh, yeah, that's not going to happen. Although, Sin Cara will get a title match in the future. But now, here's the thing. We're going to show the titles here. Well, Sin Cara did tweet out on Twitter that the Jobber Championship will be vacated. And if we're trying to determine the new one, yes. Will be determined at a later time. And also, I'm sad to say, it's time to delete Ziggler and Swagger because it's pretty safe to say that feud is good. But now, it's time to create a new team. Of course, the members, you guys saw what happened earlier. Saw earlier. It'll be, of course, I'm referring to Ali Ghirardelli. And Jinder Mahal. Wait, where is he? There he is. And also, we're going to use the... Hey, the Ascension's in here, and yet they're not even in the game. We're going to use the Brothers of Destruction on there, the Brotherhood. Wait, Brotherhood? D d d isn't this where Goldust came up with that name? The Chess Club. The Corporation, the Crew Demolition, Doom, the Doom Brigade, the Eliminators, Evolution. But I know there was one name in here I actually like. The Job Squad is in here. Gee, Al Snow is probably going to be proud of that. Of course, I'm choosing the Ministry of Darkness. No, the Nation of Domination. Where's the Middle Easterns? We're going to go with the Outsiders, I guess. And we're going to go with the Middle Easterns. As their Middle Easterns. As their tag team name.
tag team entrance. I'm actually going to work on that. And our next tag team we uh, that we saw, we're going to call them the Funky Patriots. If you guys haven't gotten that joke, if you guys haven't gotten it yet, Of course, you saw it during this during this part. Okay, what team am I going to use this one? This one I have a little problem with. We're going to go with representing the a lot the agents, I guess. The members It'll be Brodus Clay and Jack Swagger. Okay, looks like uh Okay. And that's going to be it. That's pretty much gonna do it guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll set the card up right now and I'll see you guys.